So, while we talk about everything that's going on in South Africa, let us not re- forget that South Africa has a tourism spot where people come to spend time with their families, their loved ones. I'm marketing South Africa, yes, because I'm not a bitter person that will talk about the bad and not talk about the good, right? So, in South Africa, if you want to travel, you should, you know, look out for this particular amazing spot to go so, so there are people have been on the comment section talking about the different things they think this person had not mentioned. And then I would like us to go through the comments. And somebody in this comment section said, you will be pleased to know that we haven't had load shading for the past, for more than 100 days, crossing fingers. And then the owner of the channel said, how, re-, he said, wow, really, how come? Mm-hmm. Meaning that this low shading of a thing we've been talking about is, is a thing in South Africa, but they're trying to suppress it. But please remember the reason for this video is that you could travel to South Africa for tourism purposes, right? So we, as we balance things, we make you see the bad side, the good side, and the ugly side. That is why we are here. The next person said, South Africa is one of the best and amazing um, countries in the continent coming from the Philippines. You understand? The person said. This other person said, besides the beautiful beaches, South Africa has so many things to do and explore. The next person said, in the scenery is beautiful. So only in South Africa will you still find some. I think you should say only South Africa is one of the places you still find pure nature and vast as unspoiled great video. This person says, South Africa, let's go. This other person says, indeed, you miss the most beautiful spot of South Africa, the wild coast. So if you are intending to travel to South Africa, please visit the wild coast. So that's why I thought to mention that. And this person said, beautiful South Africa. Porani Jamat, wonderful, five star, thanks, beautiful, okay, my beautiful Bangladesh. Another person said, the new favorite explorers, this other person say, great country in the planet. So another person said, unlikely, it's got a ton of social issues. So he said, it's a great country, but another South Africa say, unlikely, it got a ton of social issues. This other person say, where are they no where are they no social issues even with the with its problems? South Africa is stinkingly beautiful countries a country. So another person said, so are a lot of countries and many of them have more or less issues. Believe me, South Africa and all that. Meaning that this South African person is saying that South Africa is not all that because there are some issue there are some other countries in the continent that are so beautiful and south africa is not all that they are beautiful and they have less social vices okay let's move on this person say my point is that south african problems don't take away its natural beauty okay that's what the guy meant this other person said of course agree this all goes back to saying someone saying south africa is great country on the planet and that's true that is clearly untrue that he shouldn't say south africa is a great country in the planet because it's untrue because of the social vices this person said i guess many people all over the globe claim that their country is the best however that's untrue either but it is their opinion okay let's move on this person said can can't believe the wild coast was not included in the top 15 because this particular person was mentioning the top 15 and omitted that this other person said thanks for visiting our country and the person say with the help of immense translate you can learn the interesting language of the world for free this other person typed in this language and said nice video the other person said i have been dreaming to visit south africa since high school okay somebody replied and say yeah come along it's lovely here yeah, where your light goes off and you're you left in darkness. Wow. Why are you saying that? We we are trying to promote South Africa. Why are you not saying that the lights will go off? Hmm? It's in, it's in not something you should hide small small. But you know, when they are in the platform where it's not Nigerian, 
dominated they speak their minds they tell people what south africans are actually dealing with okay this one say i'm in south africa now about 150 miles outside cape town it's in it's incredible i i would indulge in all the adventure activity couldn't help myself shark diving is m the most thrilling thing i have ever done wow that's good so when you visit south africa do not forget to do the shark diving this person say we have a great country okay then the next person say love out loud you must want to work on your culture and crime oh my god this person is saying the crime rate in south africa is on the high and this person happens to be a south african and I think it's a white South Africa because his picture is showing white. So I don't know why he's saying they should work on the, the insecurity there. The crime rate is high. Somebody said about Mutsini beaches. I hope I pronounce it correctly. Mutunzini beaches. Probably the longest beach in the country. Located on the north coast. Settled in a wildlife environment best swimming beach i've ever came, came across is what he wrote to near rich spay it is a mossy very remote and underrated so if you are visiting that place you need to take note of that it was a beautiful country the next person say they were created and formed to be nice this one says, our country is big and beautiful with different attractions. I just love it. This next person said, this is wondersome. And that person said, I love my country. It shows here. This one says, excellent video. South Africa has such vast amount of natural beauty to see and enjoy. Look forward to seeing some of the sites you highlighted on my next visit to South Africa. Please visit these places and then um i'm the one saying you should visit though i'm calling in people to come to south africa hmm? forget about the insecurity to be sorted out oh don't allow anybody tell you this one say awesome this one said amazing the next person said they get low shading so you see the low shading thing is what they're still talking about which can be sorted when the government mean business this one said um and these are just some of the amazing places to see. There are so many more. This one says, I can't believe. It says, I can't believe I have been to all the places mentioned in this video. This person said, thank you so much. I'm going to present this country in the MUN conference. I got so much information. This particular person is going for a conference and wants to present the country. You see why it's good to talk good about other people's country so that they can talk good about your own country. You see, so it's amazing videos make me want to go for my next trip. You see there, this one say can traveler bring drones to South Africa? Um, I'm not a South Africa, but I say I can say yes. But before you fly any drone, you need to seek their their approval every country has um that law you must seek approval to fly a drone i hope if you are a south african watching this i hope i'm correct because in my country in all other african countries you need to take permission or seek for permission for flying a drone this one is a more amazing motherland and that person say wildlife is a great experience this other person say our beautiful south africa and that person say our Wow, our mother city, absolutely amazing. Should definitely be in education. And that person say, wow, beautiful places. I never knew exists in South Africa. An excellent job. Apparently, this person is a South African, but never knew these places existed. I hope that they, they put out more of these. This was a very good content. Thank you. Other person say, update. He said, Tungela Falls is now recognized as the highest waterfall in the world already we didn't know that but we have a lot of waterfalls in nigeria in case you might want to check that out mm, this one say and they are all very natural falls this one say thank you for the help this one say good this one say welcome to south africa a beautiful countryside this one say what about the video i just saw about cape town's crime uh, over three thousand people murdered per year car hijacking 
um do, 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 and mansions have private security and cameras and spikes on top of private walls they have a gang called the americans and are proud of all the murderers murders they have committed reasons i ask is are all were planning for a trip in november meaning that don't discourage people to go to south africa well let's see what the host commented he said just Stay away from the ghettos and you will be fine. Uh -uh, South Africa has ghetto. Don't say that too. We didn't have any issues at all and were there for over two months. It all comes down to doing your own research and common sense. Oh, wow. So there are places that people are not supposed to go in South Africa. Hey, we. Because this person said they have over 3,000 mothers per, per year in South Africa. No, no. People shouldn't have you know allow that kind of thing to happen what this was a Ka kalahari is missing too so please when next you are visiting visit kalahari i don't know how safe it is but of course they will definitely want to make those places safe for people to visit please visit them this one say is it safe to travel there right now with camera gear the person this other person now said i traveled the country ex extensively with a photographer on board so far so far they travel with a local wherever wherever this one says always felt safe we were traveling with our camera gears as well as we had no issues is stick to safe area just stick to safe area so there are areas in south africa that are not safe people should not be spoiling this gist now